the 119 machine you can see team earning the badger who needs more power on the mini twin i do we felt he let himself down he let me down he just let a lot of people down we were disappointed it was a disgrace absolute disgrace i'm surprised he's been allowed back to be honest okay mega shed diary 21st of september again uh i'm gonna be fitting a new brake master cylinder on the 125 um i've always thought the brakes were perfectly adequate on this um i've just got it's actually an aftermarket copy of the standard honda one the standard caliper as well but i've been recommended that these adeline chinese uh, master cylinders are good so i've got one it's a 14 millimeter diameter one it's the smallest of them so it should have that should make it longer travel better mechanical advantage um than a larger one basically but uh, they're about 60 quid got them from pit bike parts you know parker racing came with uh free stickers parker racing adlin just got them off ebay so it's about 60 quid for that and i got a spare brake lever as well because you know, obviously the standard ones don't fit so i need need a spare in case of crash but it looks pretty well made so i'm just gonna leave the camera running and do a bit of a fast fast paced uh stop motion thing of uh, fitting it and then i'll see what it's like next time i ride it Whoops. says that these can be used as a brake or a clutch because you can swap them upside down and turn all of the bits round so it'll go either way quite clever Well, I wasn't sure where to put this, didn't come with any pictures or instructions. Uh, I thought this would be to put a mirror attachment in if you're going to have a mirror on it, but I would, I would think it's for the, for the reservoir. So, uh, not got a lot of space between this bit bike throttle and, the, and that, but let's see if it goes in here. I think I missed a bit there, but I've had to juggle around to move it so I can fit in here. And now I'm going to, have to take this bit off. Banjo bolt fit on the bottom here. Let's see, uh, it's going to get some gloves on and some brake fluid. Fresh brake fluid, freshish.
Well that's looking good already. I just bled nicely from this bleed nipple on the top, which is quite useful. I think I might just lift it up that way a bit, twist it round. Uh, I shall do that with the handlebars. I've just twisted the handlebar around so that the bleed nipple is at the highest point on this, just to see if I can get any more air out of it, because it was pointing down before. Um, just see if that works. But I've already got good feel from the lever and I haven't even bled the bottom of it yet. Jobs are good. And mm. a bit tight there. Might have to trim the fairing or move the angle of the cylinder. Actually, it's fine. Now I've got this. I've got it in the right place. Okay, I'm fairly pleased with that. Got the fair and back on, it just clears it. Um, fails good. I'll have to test it on the road. Um, not going to be using it once more this year. I'm entered for uh, Mallory Park at Emra the last round to do 125, which I've not done before. Um, yeah, really pleased with this. It's got a good spanner just to run it. Uh, as I say, it cost 60 quid for all the bits, and then I bought a spare brake lever for another 20 so let's see what that's like people tell me it's good but we'll find out when i ride it mega shit out <laughs>